Yo what's going on guys, JBH here and welcome to a brand new series where today we're kicking off the 2018 season in Major League Baseball. This year I'm going to be playing as my favourite team, the New York Mets, and today is opening day. We got the first game of the season against the St. Louis Cardinals. We're at home so we're looking to try and get this season off to a good start today. Just before I get into the game I might just take you guys through some of the settings that I'll be using. So we're going to have the hitting difficulty set to veteran. I like to use zone as the hitting interface. Uh, buttons and fisheye view. So all this sort of basic stuff. I like to keep the ball trail off and guess pitch off. Try and keep it as realistic as possible. Alright, base running decisions are assisted. Pitching, all star. I like to use the pulse. Uh, pulse. Pulse. <laughs> uh, pitching sort of interface we got the meter displays that just that default circle that pulses in and out for those that know the MLB sort of gameplay or the way it works all right pitching view will be playing it as a like a broadcast view uh, for those that don't know on my channel I like to keep my sports games and sim racing as realistic as possible and try and keep it in accordance with real life as possible so we're playing as if we're watching it through the TV screen at home ball trail on so I like to see where it's going into the strike zone. Fielding, got it set to all stars. Really not much to fielding. I mean, there is, but difficulty wise, not really. Uh, throwing interface will be the buttons. I like to use the throwing meter. Uh, and it's all sort of manual for the most part. So yeah, that is about right. That should be on assist. Sorry, I just noticed that. All right. And then just the general settings right here all right so that is about it for the setting side of things presentation options as again I said like to keep it as broadcast TV broadcast on the audio side of things as well mode specific I'm going to be uh, adjusting all the roster manually throughout the years uh, roster moves however so down to uh, sending players down back and from the miners I'm sort of just gonna make that automatic uh, scouting is all auto since I'm not scouting for another season I'm only playing the one franchise mode and uh, uh, sorry the one year in franchise mode in this franchise mode I should say bleh, speak English Joseph drafting and all that's manual I'm gonna try and keep the team as realistic throughout the year as possible so in accordance to real life the best that I can so I'll try and keep that squad looking like it is in the real world oh sorry wrong one all right so that is about it for the setting side of things we're going to be playing the full season i'm going to do my best to upload at least two videos per week uh we'll see how some of the other scheduling stuff goes as i play so many different types of sports and motorsports now so yeah without any further ado we'll jump straight into this one see if we can get a good result in the first game of the year Alright, City Field, good to be back. Uh, just gonna set that all to just what it is. Alright, Syndergaard will be on the mound tonight, or today, I should say. And that is the batting order. Alright, here we go. So, for those that uh, don't know, I actually do have quite a bit of experience on these MLB games, or MLB The Show as it's called. I didn't play too much last year, but throughout 26, uh, 2016 and 2015, I did play quite a lot. Sort of really got into baseball while living in the US and spent a bit of time in New York and fell in love with the Mets. And their, well, especially with their pitching. I'm a big fan of Syndergaard and DeGrom. Daytime baseball here on MLB Network. Opening day is here as we get the new season underway with a good matchup between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Mets. Hello again, everybody. Baseball is back. Welcome to our special opening day broadcast on MLB Network. Joined by Dan Plezak and Dan as we get things going this season it's pitching that has to be key if this team's going to have success. 
You know, I always think pitching and defense are the keys to success in the long run. So as the season gets started, it's going to be really important for this pitching staff to set a good tone. If they can get off on a good foot, it will do a lot for the confidence of the entire ball club. The games count starting now. Opening day on MLB Network, and it's coming up next. Back now as we draw ever closer to first pitch. Let's listen in to public address announcer Mike Carlucci. And now your 2018 New York Mets. Quickly now we'll look at the two men who are entrusted with the starting pitching assignment here to begin the new year. Now a chance to look at the starting nine for the visiting St. Louis Cardinals. Mark what do you have on this lineup as they go for their first win. Well Matty you take a look at this lineup today going against a power arm on the other side. You could see a little bit of uh, ambush tactics employed by this offense in this lineup swinging the bat early not wanting to go too deep in the count where he can rack up a ton of strikeouts be on the lookout for some early swings out of this lineup Noah Syndergaard gets the call to pitch here on opening day in front of the hometown crowd. What do we need to know here Danny. Hey what do you think of the power arms in baseball. This is the first guy you think of. Noah Syndergaard big strong guy throws 89 to 93 mile an hour sliders that's right sliders his fastball anywhere from 97 to 101 miles an hour power fastball power slider and a terrific changeup one of the best pitchers in the game of baseball. Stepping into the box, Dexter Fowler. He will lead this one off Leading today. Off the afternoon for St. Louis. All right, here we go. First pitch Dexter of the year. Man, Fowler. have I been excited for this one. Set a sinker right in the bottom left side of the Here's strike the zone. Didn't quite get that one right. And spring oh, gosh, thought <laughs> I thought I was going to hit him there for the first pitch of the year. That would have been embarrassing. Turn that shit off. All right, here we go. Pitch number two. It's a little bit better. <laughs> and a there we go. Even First the strike count. of the year. One and one. The one-one home. Line to shortstop, and there's one away. There we go. It's the first out. First baseman, Jose Martinez. At and the play, Fowler Jose will have Martinez. to walk after He'll just three pitches. His first cuts here. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And that one just missed out. Almost caught the corner. Cindergard, or Thor as he's often known. He was a first round pick <laughs> back in the 2010 first year player draft. Yeah, Maddie, they certainly got it right when they drafted this guy. He has turned himself into an absolute superstar. Everybody knows this guy's name, and kids are buying his jerseys. Outside, nah. He's off again, and it's 2 0. Time to take 99 a look at the Nine miles an hour. That is moving. Is Mike Fillmore. Hey, you know, D-Roll, Mike Fillmore, he'll give a little bit off the edges, but he gets the respect not only from the pitchers, but from the players because his zone is consistent. Yeah, as long as he's consistent, Dan, I'm okay with Mike Fillmore's zone. If a pitcher's pounding that zone, he wants to give a little bit off the outer edge, I'm okay Foul with ball. that. Foul ball. One out, nobody of on. the year. Send another fastball high in the zone. Fouled off. Two and two. Come on. A 
would be such an awesome way to start today's game if we can, well, start this year if we can get through the first innings without a hit. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Now a swing oh, and a chance for right, I definitely need to turn that off. Over at first. Hold on, just quickly. Uh, and he'll take oh, it to the wait. bag himself for the out. Batting third, center field number 20, Tommy Fan. Hold up. Let me just go and sort that shit out. Uh, presentation options. No, nope, not that one. Gameplay options. Uh, general. Alright, tutorial tips. Turn all that shit off. Awesome. Into the box. Tommy Pham. Career numbers right. versus Syndergaard. He's two for four. Fastball and he swings through it. Big to swing, no ding. This offense has been warned. If they didn't know already, now they do know. He's got his A-game fastball with him today. Bases are empty here with two men out. I swear it just got sunny. Or maybe my eyes are playing with me. <laughs> huh. Fam with an even one and one count now. Fam, a six foot one inch right handed swinger and thrower. He was a 16th round selection during the first year player draft of 2006. I know this guy wouldn't go into the category of superstar, but to grind out the career he has being drafted where he was, my hat's off to him. A ball and two strikes now. The one two. Seared down the yeah. first baseline. But this is a foul ball. Thought we were going to have him there. Steady at one and two. Hit on the ground to third. Oh, slightly missed Quincy inside, but we'll get it. And it'll be three on and three out to start the year. Perfect. One, two, three, go All right. to Nothing for the Cardinals to start. Mets coming to bat. We're just getting started ourselves on MLB Network. With a moment here in Flushing Meadows, let's meet the Mets. Vero, what do you got in this lineup in the series opener? Matt, do you take a look at this lineup? I find myself thinking back to my playing days when I knew I had the ace on the mound. It had to be wind day, and when you get in a car to drive to the yard, you tell yourself... You All right, here we go. First it, time on the plate for 2018. The on the big boy to have to execute Let's see how quickly it all comes does. back to me. <laughs> this to may be embarrassing. Execute and score, manufacture, come on, JBH, get this right. The St. Louis Cardinals attack you on defense in this fashion. And this team, they're not going to be moving around as much as some of the new age teams. The shifting and moving the third baseman over second base and the right fielder to play third base. This is going to be your stationary team trusting pitchers to execute pitches. In now, Jose Reyes. Jose! He's off here in the bottom half of the first. Mr. Reyes, all right, here we go. Might see a pitch or two first. Ready, here's the first offering. Takes a knee high fastball. 97, damn, this guy's pretty quick. Jesus Christ. Alright. Into the one interesting day, I can tell you that much. Pop ah. and it looks like that's Drop gonna foul. make it into the VIP seats. Alright, well that's not what we wanted. A ball and two strikes to Jose Reyes. Boy, it's hard to sit on an 0-2 fastball. I think that pitch just locked him up a bit. But lucky for him, it was just a little out of the zone. Oh, I knew there was going to be a changeup, and we got a hit. <laughs> yes, I thought he was going to fall, well, fall short to the shortstop there, but hey, you be damn. The on the attack, yes. Question. In the bottom of the <laughs> first, off with a first man up, first Everyone hit on the year. Yeehaw. All right, Cabrera steps up to the plate now. Let's see if we can get a run early in this game. Cabrera. 
at that perfectly down the middle. Here comes the first pitch. Swinging ah, the just come on, Joseph. A lively fastball. Getting too excited now. Looking at straight oh, two, fuck. A that, catches the <laughs> that was a good corner. pitch. That was a really good pitch. Gosh, we're in 0-2 again. <laughs> and here's a swing and oh, a miss from far out. That was appalling. <laughs> the I felt the change right up. I saw well, I saw the change up and I thought it was gonna be inside, but just on the corner. He uses it, pulls the string, too late anyway. Alright. Into the stop is Conforto. As he'll pop this one foul off to the left and out of play. Too late. First swings for him in this one with the runner still at first and one gone. Now a throw over and he just manages to get his hand in. <laughs> you reckon the umpire thinks he's safe? And this is oh, uh, get there, get there, get there, get there. The yes. There. Get bit late to react to that one, but that helps a lot. And I think that's the case of the pitcher being a little too preoccupied with the speed at first. He lost a little bit sloppy here, the Cardinals. The and throws an it's a good start. Scud. The irony, Just of need to get one more man on base. On second, and he didn't and even have really to steal. in a good situation. Yes, oh, fuck. Martinez fuck, 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 has fuck, fuck, a play. <laughs> he hauls it in without any I, trouble. I don't know Here why. I thought away. I just my, I pulled the left trigger all the way down, so I just got underneath that one big time. Why I did that. Anyway, here's the big man. Franchise player, Yuena Cespedes. Serious power. First delivery to him on the way. Takes a high ah. ball for a strike. He might want that. Question is, do I steal? That's a Reyes has got really 75 pace. You have the right approach towards that opposite field gap. You can definitely steal one or two. Work him out of the down the line. Just a bit late, and he's fallen behind. 0 and 2. Fuck. 0 and 2 again. Reyes stands at second with two gone. The bouncer to the ah. side. Carpenter is there. Throw to first will get it easily, and the side is retired. Met strand one, and this is still a nothing, nothing ball game. Well, we had our first hit. Managed to get him on second, so that's all right. It's a decent start. Should have been better. The next to bat for St. Louis, Paul DeYoung. All right, second innings. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Now a swing and a ground ball. The wind up and the 0 1. Another one fouled ah. off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Come on. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Now he gets on top oh, of one here and shots close. it foul right at home plate. Nope. The next 0-2 misses, and that'll well, be to 1-2 one one two two. now. Hey, I can understand why he wanted to elevate the fastball right there. This batter's eyes have been lit up since he stepped in the box. Let's see if he gets him fishing on something breaking in the dirt right here. The one-two. Swung on and missed strike. Two. Ah, the commentator called it. Another strikeout for him on the mound. Yeah, it is it fun to watch him go about his business? Ah, no doubt, Matty. He's one of my favorites, mostly because of his stuff. 
you know he can absolutely dominate on any given day because of what he offers up there. It's just nasty. There aren't many hitters that like to see this guy on the mound. Here's Matt Carpenter. As he'll take a look at a high strike that time, it's nothing in one. Career numbers versus Syndergaard. He's hitless in three at bats. That's in there, and he's deep Boom, in the hole. Two. Now, and two. Ahead once he again. Some really good it's been a good start from Syndergaard. Right there. It's hard to do just anything with that pitch rolling. unless you're sitting on it and catch it out front before it breaks all the way in. And a swing and a miss. Ooh, they got cramped him up. Carpenter has to walk. Really good late bite on so that I do like right to use there. the, I mean, the you, have that goes, late bleh, you guys have already noticed by now, but so I do like to use the suggested pitches. Um, I've only been sort of following pitch. baseball for three or four years now, so I'm still learning the game. Unfortunately, where I live in Australia, and, well, having just moved to the UK as well, there's not too much of a Here's baseball Marcelo following Zuna. in those parts of the world. So yeah, I sort of just fell in love with the game while living the in the time. U.S. for a bit he'll there, on keeping this top of the and I've sort of stuck with it ever since. So I watch it when I can. I mean, we, of course, we get like one or two games uh, every couple of days, and if it's the Mets, then I'll stay up and watch it. But yeah, unfortunately, it's it's, a, it's just really hard to keep Way up and, and, and learn the game when two. you're not amid the at the atmosphere of the game itself. I say throw everything so, out. O2. yeah, I'm He's using the suggested ball. pitches for now. No I do like to, we play um, two. you know, place them in certain spots, but I just want to know where to, where the best place is to place them at certain times in the count. High Missed in the air inside, the but field. we'll get it. Cespedes is there. Cespedes. Down in order go the Cardinals. <laughs> All right. We'll go to the bottom no of the hit second. once again. No score. Next for the Mets, Jay Bruce. Bruce. Yeah. Bruce. Five, six, and right seven here, here to start the home half hey. of the second. Bruce. All right. See if we can go. A little bit better. I can still still see that the pitch. shift is still on against Bruce. <laughs> Wing and ah, Wing come on, Joseph. See that shit. What a well Got to see that better. Right there, just a little bit off the corner right there. Got a great hitter to go a little bit outside his zone. The pitch. And now a curveball bounces up to the plate. It's one and one. Saw that one. The 1-1. One, one. Pass ball taken high there for the ball. That's better. Swing. Yes. Drive. Get That's down. Yes. And this Come on. Get all the way out Let's try for two. Sign now. Yes. And he's all right. Second now with nobody out. That was a great job of driving that ball. Even against the Extending shift, we still managed well to get it down. Get it over the right fielder's that head. contact swing one right in the middle. The for an easy double. That's one of those solid hits that you don't even feel coming off the bat. Here's Todd Frazier now. His head to head number. All right, Todd Frazier. Carlos now, Martinez. this man I'm three for 15. not familiar He's also with. Been a strikeout victim six times. He was not in the squad early last year. I sort of stopped following the Mets. They got rid of. A lot of my favorite players, like Granderson and Walker and whatnot, so I sort of stopped following them there for a bit. But I'm get I'm on. <laughs> I'm struggling to speak English today. Pitch, here it comes. A oh, that was a hitable hey, no one. But yeah, I'm back on the band bandwagon now. Get into the so it's time to this get back in the game and guy support this team. That it'll be interesting to see how they go right this year. We definitely got the, the pitching side of things. It's just whether or not we got the guys on the plate that'll. I mean, we've got Cespedes. We we got a lot of big names there that can get it done. And it's oh, quickly going to again begging Frazier, to be hit. A 32-year-old veteran who was selected in the first was that late round on that? back in the draft of 2007. Yeah, he has turned himself yeah. into a really nice ball player. Come on, Jason. Put him on the superstar level, but you know what? They didn't miss with this pick either. You go in the high rounds and you carve out a career the way this guy has. Nice pick. 
boy, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, you have to make sure it's up above the zone like that. He can't do a whole lot with that, but if it were a little lower, he can and will make you pay big time. The one-two gets him looking at the oh, for the strikeout. Fuck. Bullshit. Batting seven. First baseman. <laughs> Adrian. Hey, Gonzalez. Adrian Gonzalez. Yeah, she'll get his Another man that I'm pretty unfamiliar with. New name to me. <laughs> Alright, come on, Joseph. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And a fastball just a bit high. Bottom of the second here with no come score. On. I think we got the pitcher in after this, Syndergaard, so can't screw this one up. Bouncer yes! Up and that's through into Go home. Field, base hit. No, and no, no. Risk it at third, so they're at the corners now. Only one away. Yes, we needed that. There's a hard hit ground ball. Pitcher not able to get a glove on it. Hard single up the middle. Yeah, watch your lips right there, Dad. Sent it back right Straight down the guts. All right. Here's the catcher, Travis Darno. As he'll send a ah. ball down to third. Yeah, double play. Second for one. Relay the oh. first game. And just like that, the oh. side is retired. Oh, Joseph. The horn, they go. Five to you four had it in the palm the of your hand, and you went and did it up like that. Ah. Bruh. Back at City Field in Flushing, I can't Queens, as we are that. ready for the third inning in this one. Here's Jed Jerko now. Again, I'm getting so excited. Here, I start hitting it everything. Idiot. That's all right. At least we're getting on base. We're putting some numbers on the total pitches for this guy. So it's all right. We haven't had a hit against us yet. So it's a good start to the game. Just, yeah. Over the season, we'll stop making stupid mistakes like that. First offering on its way. Oh, and won the count. Problem is those double plays just give the other team confidence. It's the worst feeling in the world for any baseball team to have a double play against you. Or well, besides a home run, of course. Or a, a grand slam. <laughs> Couldn't get any worse than that. Put this one outside. Inside, as he might be trying to set him up here, one and two. That's right, good that pitch. pitch right there. He's trying to keep him from getting his arms extended. If it's out over the plate more, he can obviously do a lot of damage with it. Fastball, got him. First out, got him. Boy, that's the best pitch in baseball right there with two strikes. That elevated fastball. Every hitter thinks that, hey, they can do something with that, but most of the time, you get the result that you saw right there. A big swing and a miss, and another strikeout. Here's the catcher, Yadier Molina. As he'll take a look at a curveball that misses wide for ball one. Cardinals have been held out of the hit column here. One. Definitely got some pitches piling up. So, really, for a starting pitcher, you sort of don't want to give up any more than 11 pitches per uh, per innings. The one one. Or else you'll start. You'll end up above 100 and tired and, one and two done. That's to be switched out. I mean, if the scores are still level or close, then you end up sacrificing the starting pitcher anyway, bringing in the relievers. The one two. Is laid off for ball two. Make them substitutions later on, but two and two. You're not going to be an easy day's work for a Syndergaard. Here now the two two. Place this one right on the corner. Is a win. Yeah, yes. He struck him out. Batting ninth. 
So in now is the Cardinals pitcher Carlos Martinez and then it seems like this starter is just dominating the game right now feels like we're seeing a lot of three up three down innings. No doubt about that Matt. Hey I've enjoyed watching him go about his business but I'm also interested to see if this offense can figure out a way to get a couple of cracks in his armor before it gets too late. Yeah that remains to be seen. First pitch of the at bat. Takes a look at oh. one catching the outside corner. He looks really strong here early in this game and that fastball is a good example. Put that thing in a great spot and right where he wanted it. Into the windup here comes the 0 and 1. A wave and a miss oh. a tick behind a good fastball. Get it ready big boy. This guy's throwing three digits right here. The best way I can help the fans is 90 to 92. You can that one was 100 scenes. far out. 92 to 95. 100. It starts to really quicken up on you. Over three digits, you're seeing a white blur. Slider whiffed on <laughs> for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Damn, three 100 three miles an hour. I couldn't. Not too shabby. Couldn't imagine two and a, a half, baseball no coming at me at 100 miles an hour, let alone fucking 80 miles an hour. <laughs> Next to hit will be the pitcher, Noah Syndergaard, as we move on to the bottom Pitcher. of inning number three. Noah Syndergaard. All right, so we've got the pitcher straight on. He's See ready. Here's the first offering. Get some sort of miracle shot here. Hot shot ah. to third and handled for the first down. We got back to it, I suppose. Think of the positives. Back to the top of the order now, and stepping in is the shortstop, Jose Reyes. Come on. Good contact, just a bit late. Here's the first offering. Just missed with a breaking ball. Bases are empty, one man out. Two and no. Nope. <laughs> Three and a. Well, he was definitely looking fastball here, and he got one. But that was good discipline to lay off and get himself into a 3-0 count. A three-ball, one-strike count to the Mets shortstop. Yeah, I thought he was going to do that one. Come on. Walk this boy. Fastball to ah. the strike, and he Bullshit. runs it full three and two. Now the three and two pitch. Back up. Yes. Pitch. And that'll get on through into center, and he's got himself a one out. First. Hey, sometimes you get lucky right there. It looked like a three-two pitch out of the zone could have got on base via the walk, but he wanted to knock it. Cabrera. <laughs> Another hit. We've got four in that column now. That's that's actually two out of two for Here Jose. now is his dribble Cabrera batting left-handed oh, here as he takes a look at gonna hit that one. one. Should have had a dig at that one. Probably could have sent that try. to the right side. It's okay. It's okay. Lifted down the ah. line left. Blah, blah, blah. And this will wind up a foul ball. Reyes stands at first with one out. Oh. Tried to get him to oh, go yeah, after one that below one. the knees, but it's one and two. <coughs> Come on. Don't want to... Yeah, all right. All right. Yeah, no, I, I get you. Yeah, I understand. Do the creep ball. Oh. Now a throw over the first. <laughs> oh, go, 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 go. No, 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 no. Oh gosh. Alright. Situation normal. 
to two balls and two strikes now. He's asking for it. Yeah, no, I, I understand. No, I, I get you. You don't have to. You don't have to signal it twice. Sent in yes. The air at the uh, center. Get fan uh, has a read on it. Two gone. Probably could have tagged up there. Ugh. Wrong swing. Tried to make it contact. I tried just to get a contact swing, I should say, and could not get her fair enough downfield. Stepping in, Michael Conforto. His last at bat did All right, go his popped way. out in the first. Did Conforto? Let's see if we can improve on this one. First pitch coming. Here it is. Skyed in the air. Oh, he's done away. it again. Exact Ozuna same thing. Is under Fuck. It. And the inning God is damn over. It. One pitch. What? <laughs> eh, why? We'll head to the We've had four freaking hits. Florida. Just can't seem to get them all in one go. Here's Dexter Fowler now. He starts off the inning against a guy who struck out the side last going. inning. How do they get to Oh, man. It's sure. been a long man, day here in the UK. Patient. He's been throwing a lot of strikes. They might want to start swinging Went a little bit earlier Went to watch the, the England versus Italy game last night. That was quite an experience. Celebrated by 100 subscribers. <laughs> I guess it's a bit embarrassing when you say it like that. But everyone's got to start somewhere. If you uh, haven't seen, I posted a compilation to thank everyone that's liked, yeah, subscribed, and there, viewed my content. The zone for ball one. Uh, that'll be well, the previous video defense, to this one, or two this videos back. Game for you. Are you happy so, with yeah, that, that was yeah? a uh, good celebration, good fun night out. While, Matt. Both of these pitchers are throwing very well, throwing strikes, having good command of their off-speed pitches. This is going to be one of those low-scoring affairs. But yeah, no, it was a bit... Game-wise, it was a bit disappointing. Uh, we actually managed to score first, uh, as in England. I'm English, obviously. Well, I sound Australian, but I'm actually English. And then, st uh, in like 10 minutes to go, Italy went and had a guy fall down in the box, and the referee actually went and made a vir like a video replay, like went to a video replay, which I mean, in most sports is normal, but in football or soccer. It's like unheard of. I'd never, I'd never, I'd never, I've never heard of a Still ref going two. to a video replay in football or soccer. I mean, that's just, I had no idea what was going on. So me and me and my dad, we just got up and left. We couldn't believe it. So <laughs> like, I'm not watching this shit. The one two. I mean, it was a good experience. Wembley's an amazing stadium, and eighty thousand people. Oh, him tied him up. Boy, but yeah, no, really that was disappointing the into right the night. As we roll through it again, remember, he struck out the side in the last inning, and now he picks up right where he left off by striking off the leadoff man here. Let's see if he can keep this going for a little bit. In now, Jose Martinez. As he'll take a tough pitch on the outside part of the plate for strike one. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Behind 0 and 2 now. Wind up and the 0 2 pitch to short. Yes, get right that. There is Reyes. And there's out awesome. number two. Two down, one to go the in the Cardinals. fourth. Center fielder, Tommy Fan. Stepping in for the Cardinals, Tommy Fan. This guy's still looking at a zero in the hit column. Here comes the first pitch. Nope. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. The 
the 1 0 home. Swinging a soft liner. Yes. Uh, this won't get past the wow, so after four in innings, short, innings, still no over. hit One, two, three, from the Cardinals. the Cardinals. On to the bottom of the fourth now, still with no score. Digging in for his second at bat. Joanna Cespedes. This. Fourth inning. this game is rolling right. right along as we move into He's the middle. He's a big inning. man. With no score. Come on. you think by Gotta now put one something of these on the board. teams would be able to get some base runners on and get him in, but that hasn't been the case. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Ah, oh, that is a home run ball right there. Oh, Jesus, Joseph. Give up an opportunity like that. Just slightly underneath it. Should have moved up a bit. Hot shot yes. On the oh, ground is short. DeYoung gathers it in. And there's one away. Found that one just a bit early. Eyes lit up. It was a fastball right down the middle. And he hit it hard, but he couldn't elevate it at all. Would have been a different story if he did. Oh yeah, that would have been up where we left off. Jay Bruce tenth tier, <laughs> if there was one. Last at -bat with All right, come big on, Bruce. Right here. Just infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, wow. but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. Come on, Bruce. He put us on the board. Ah, no, 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 no. Pitching has the God, upper just hand too late. Fuck, look at that. Number four. And this one misses to Bruce as he Ooh, moves out in front. It's two and one. Seems to me like they're pitching him a little bit more cautiously after that double he had his first time up. Come on, Brucey. Show me the money. Into the windup. Here's the two and one pitch. This is it. Yeah, oh. in the air out toward left center. Get the oh, far out. Under it's so hard to tell how much they've now. got a hold of it until you really start to see where the fielder moves to. That one, my eyes got lit. <laughs> my eyes lit up. I got really quite excited there. But I uh, wasn't enough in behind it. Again. wasn't straight Todd enough. Frazier comes into this at oh, sorry, wasn't for one in the ball game. low enough off the bat. Yeah, just got underneath it a bit there. First delivery oh, well. to him on the way. He's got a piece uh, of the fastball uh, that time as his chop foul at the plate for strike one. Two out, nobody on. Why am I going up on it? Right there. Oh, uh, that was begging to be hit. Hey, that's case in point Come right on. there. He thought that was going to hollow out his rib and ended up being a strike. <sighs> Come on, Joseph. Not a bad oh, pitch there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. It was way outside. The one two. Misses, ball two. Way down low. Kind of pitching him backwards in this AB. It's good. Soft stuff it's early. Good. Then those up last the pitches. two were fastballs, trying to get it right by him. This should end the inning. Ah, as chased it. Second. Throw in the dirt, but Ooh. a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. Mets All right. On one, two, three, through four. Still no tied. hit in Nothing that happened. inning. Both teams actually still scoreless. So that brings in the power hitting middle Maybe infielder Paul the Young. He'll start things out against Noah Syndergaard as this Hold inning is underway. Jong. We're moving through the middle of this ball game right now. They want to get things going. How about trying to get some base runners on or at least get a base hit? They don't have any hits going into this part of the game. He'll be kicking himself tonight if he doesn't come up with a big knock right here. That pitch was in a hittable location, and a hitter of this caliber usually doesn't let that go by. This is flared out towards second. Oh, uh, can't come up uh, with it. And a yes. great job to stick with it here as he gets the first down of the inning. Cabrera, don't scare me like that. Carpenter. One away now, and here's Matt Carpenter. Carpentier. 
Here's Ooh, the first pitch to him. It's a bit of a risky one. Takes a look at a slider that catches the inside corner. Pitch this one out. Now he turns on a yes, fastball he chased and it. sends it deep down the right field line. Oh and gosh, it wasn't far away though. <laughs> that circle back, kept moving back. <laughs> quite scared there for a second. To start talking about these things. Mm -hmm. There you go, right there. A big goose egg in that hip right, column. Worth two keeping out. in mind as we get later into the afternoon. Yeah, it was a big goose egg in our run column. And we Ready got four freaking hits. Marcelo Zuna. He flew out in his last at bat. Cannot convert. First offering on its way. Just need Syndergaard to keep doing what he's doing. He's carrying the team right now. Oh, ball and he on. swings through it to fall behind. Missed a little bit on that one. Opening day baseball here in New York. The 0 1 pitch. Fouled away. Nice. 0 and 2, Ozuna, come on, let's end this one. A six foot one inch right handed swinger and thrower. This is the final year of his current deal, so he'll be a free agent at season's end. Yeah, Maddie, there's three dates the time you get called up, and the time you get to arbitration, and one when you finally. A swing yes. And a miss. That retired he ain't going to get no new contract that on that. Work. Down in order go the Cardinals. Halfway home, still no score. Digging in to try it again. Adrian Gonzalez as we move past. Alright, Gonzalez one for one. one. See if we can make him two for two. First pitch on its way. This is on the ah. first. Fuck. Almost squeeze that through first and second. Well executed to Seymour on the outside corner that time, and, and that's what you'll get a lot of with that pitch. Just can't he quite lift over. these. I know there may be a couple of you baseball Travis fans out there that play this He's game a lot. He's <laughs> probably looking at me like, why are you not doing this? Why are you not doing that? I just Halfway to 100 learned pitches. in the game. Here it is. Hit the other way. Ah. Uh, Fuck! There to take it as Fowler as that becomes out. I'm getting two. back to ball, but just can't lift now these ones far in. enough. From pitcher, Noah Vindergaard. Bruh. Ready for another chance? Come on, Syndergaard, Noah just Syndergaard. fucking smash it. Hard, but lined out just smash it. So that, that was that should have. Just contact swing. Swung on and missed, Ooh. outclassed by that fastball <laughs> look at, for a strike. Yeah, look at this, Freddy. Two look at the size of his power so swing. His pitch count is really down. I think one Circle. of the keys is he's been attacking the strike zone early on. Well, that's actually a little bit bigger than I thought it would be. Bat so far in this one. And a neck-high fastball that time. Mate, all you need to do is just pitch it in the zone. We ain't ever going to hit it. <laughs> This is oh, high in the air out we hit it. Left center. Fam Fortunately, it was a pop up, but we still hit it. <laughs> He's hit it twice now. And that'll end the inning. Fair to say. Oh, I think goodness. if I could actually get bat to ball on a 100 mile an hour fastball. More baseball on MLB <laughs> Network. Right after. This. Okay, that's a bit odd. Yep. Uh, okay. Here's Jed Jerko now. He'll okay, start another no hit the top run there, the but six. it's all right. We had our third lowest, or bottom three, I guess you could say. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Tough slider that just catches the corner for a strike. Oh, and one count and the pitch. Now a ball hit. Oh my the god, don't do that to me. Oh, left that left the bat like a, a rocket. But it bends that 112 miles an hour probably killed someone deck. in the crowd. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Hit weakly back to the mound. 
throw to first oh, guessing, nice. so the leadoff man Quick. is retired here to begin One the out, come on. Number four, catcher, Yadier Molina. So the leadoff man retired here, that'll bring up Yadier Molina. First offering on its way. On the ground to third. All right, there's another one pitch out. And the sixth inning is progressing All right, one left. here. Now two away. When the guy in the mound is working on a no-no this late, every play is exciting and stressful for the fielders. We'll see if they can continue making the plays behind him. Man, yeah, definitely got a pitching war on the mound Carlos today. Martinez looking to put the ball Five in innings, here. no down score. On strikes in his first at bat. First pitch of the at bat. Easy fly ball. Oh, there's another one. Center field. Cespedes is there, and they Cespedes will catch that one easy. Wow. The side is retired. One, two, three. That was a quick inning for the no uh, Cardinals. Dang it. All right, Reyes is two for two. Let's see if he can make a hat trick. Here's the shortstop now, Jose Reyes. Leading off for the mat, number seven, shortstop. All right, Jose come on. Reyes. First pitch. Jose, three for way. three. Rip down the oh, first base. Oh, he almost got it. Take it to the bag himself that was the ripped, that's for sure. Just well, couldn't quite 15, get enough sort of direction behind it, or elevation, I should say. Here now is Come on, Joseph, we've got to think about this a little bit more. Just chasing everything that's inside the zone. So far. Yeah, it's just a... Actually, that was good contact Ready just from to deliver. Here's the first timing. Pitch. Strike uh, one to strike the at-bat. Too late. See, it's either... D I mean, I'm finding it impossible to get the direct... Like the the Oh my god. Fuck. On the first and Cabrera's a ground out victim. Two away. I need to start making more power swings. I'm actually getting decent contact on some of these, but I'm not elevating them. And when I do seem to go for these power swings, I end up lofting them 50,000 feet in the air. Alright. Come on, Conforto. Here's the first pitch Needs to him. something to spring this team. High and deep down the uh, left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Come on, Joseph. The wind up and the 0-1. And one the changeup is way low that time. It's, it's like, what, do I choose whether I go for the zone hit or do I choose whether I actually try and time it perfectly? Ooh, good change up. Just Seem to inside. not be able to get both of, well, the best of both worlds right now. But now we'll keep working at it. This is my first game. Oh, chase that one. But fouled off to the left. Thank God we got back to it. Come on, Conforto. Show me the money. I need Here money. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I saw fastball. Down God, that was a good changeup. We are still scoreless. Got me good there. All right, still no hit. I mean, Welcome we've back had to four, City but that was early in the game. It seemed to have slumped since then. The run column quite Top three going the out there. Through the first six innings of play. Come on. Top of the and seventh now. The Comes in Fowler lineup. again. Stepping in. Dexter Fowler. Oh, got start the seventh Hope to go at Syndergaard. Doesn't have any sort of this. collapse. Of pitching and defense today. Oh, that's one of the keys. We're seeing a lot of strikes. We're seeing a lot of swings. We're seeing some great plays on defense. This has been a snappy one up to this point. First pitch of the at-bat on its way in tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. and oh. The 1-0 -oh home. Count even now oh. with 1-1. One and one. Bit risky there.
starts to go around here, but nice. it doesn't matter. This is strike two anyway. Another risky pitch. Missed on the accuracy there. Come on. The one two. Locks him up for strike Damn. three. Missed inside, but we'll take it. I'll tell you right now, this guy has a shutout going, and it's been all okay. business. He's not messing Where's around <coughs> trying to pick at corners. He's being aggressive. If we could get a shutout in the first game of the year, that would just be one, one heck of a up to this point. sort of standing point. One Taking heck of a once again, Jose Martinez, for two on exclamation his point put on the season. Here comes the first pitch. Took a wave at oh. one around the shins with no Got luck. him on that one. You know, we haven't seen that pitch from him in a while, but it looks like he's got pretty good feel for it. If he's going to pick and choose when he's going to use it, he could steal some strikes that way. Here comes the 0-1. Hey. Takes a knee-high fastball. This guy's pitching really well in this one so far. You could just see he's awful confident attacking the strike zone, and when he comes off the mound at the end of the inning, looks like he stepped in a big old bucket of sassy. The 0-2 delivery. Got him swinging. Yes. Chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. Pretty impressive back-to-back -back strikeouts to start the inning. What's even more important is now he gets to face the middle of the order without anybody on base for them to drive in. Stepping in now, Tommy Pham. As he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Here's the 0 1 pitch. High. And oh, deep. no. Damn it. A distance. And they have taken oh, the lead. Oh, my God. And just like that is how quick a game a of baseball can well, switch Pham. on its head. First Fuck. Run of the campaign for him. And the Cardinals Was not concentrating, front, missed inside, and boom. No hit on the entire game, and they go out and smash one out of the park in the seventh. You can call it unfair or just the breaks of the game, but up until this pitch, which was a big mistake, he was throwing a gem. Now he looks up at the scoreboard, and he's trailing. That's demoralizing, but he's got to forget about it quickly. Ouch. Actually, it wasn't a bad pitch. God, I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. Standing in that now, came out of nowhere. As he'll go after the first pitch oh, and again, bounce that it into foul well. territory. No hits to this point. Alright, now we need to start warming up our relievers. Oh, come on. I hate the way you can't just go into the freaking... There we go. Alright, Lugo and Robles. I say Hugo, I meant Lugo. And a fastball just a bit up. I mean, that is He's just so unlucky. Very impressive on that the was right on one. the corner, and, and the he just nailed it. Is his ability Can't remember to stay who that out was. Of the middle of the zone. That's kind of obvious, but it's clear <sighs> to me that even when he misses his spots, he's not missing over the plate. The one one. Swing a ball hit on the ground, yeah. but this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. And he will Boom. Him out. Ten now in the ball game, and it's a good comeback. One for the Cardinals in the inning on the solo home run. I mean, he just saw, he just lucked out on that hit. That was just, I call bullshit. <laughs> I mean, come on. We literally, they've not had a hit the whole game, and then they go and do that. All right, come on, Cespedes. Shove it back in their face, mate. Every team has need to get this guy. one. And Cannot fall behind the Mets. too far. Changes that complexion come on, that Cespedes. Betting order. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. A swing and oh, a that's hit well. Toward the gap. Fam, that's hit well. It, 
the track to the yes! Oh, yes! We needed that straight back in your face. I called that one. And our big hitter has put it over the fence. All right, now this game's getting good. He comes up in a big spot and just cranks one out of here to even the score. Not a bad time to hit your first home Just made year, it. Huh? Slightly early, but again, we got that direction right. Swung on and hit in the air again. Oh! That was drilled. It just turned on itself. I thought I thought as soon as it changed that camera, I was like, my stomach dropped. I was like, no way, we've hit two, and two for two. Slightly late, though. Oh, that was begging to be hit. Come on, Joseph. I, I just need to go away and do some training. I'll tell you what, I just need to go and practice slightly late. Oh, I agree. And this ball that wasn't foul at the plate. And that Ugh, was come on. Should have sent half of these in the fucking 10th tier. Come on. And he takes oh, what a pitch. That one hurts. We know he's probably still thinking about that game. That one hurts. Home run he just gave up. But I'm going to give him credit for not showing that it's bothering him. When you come back and strike out the next guy, it shows you've still got your head in the right place. Here's Todd Frazier now. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. Too late. Got the direction, but so got the in this timing one. run again. The wind up and the 0 1. Fastball down near the shoe tops. Come on. 1-1. One, one. Finally got some scoring in this game. One and oh, two now. damn. One run, five hits, and no errors on the Mets Come line on, score so far. Speed this timing back up. Alright, I'm calling a change up. Oh, you can tell he there it was, but it was outside the zone! The pitch anyway, and he becomes out number two. That was a big strike Damn it. there, guys. The best pitchers have the ability to strike guys out when they really need to. And that second out was way really behind it anyway. At this point of the game. Come on. Could be something we look back on later when the game's over. Here's Adrian now. There's oh, that's been nailed. Here we go. Come on. Yes! Woohoo! Well. We had four hits early in the game, then went through a bit of a slump, and now we've just hit two homers in the bottom of the seventh. Man, I did not see that coming. I mean, we were getting bat on ball there for a while, I just couldn't quite get the timing right. Well, I couldn't quite get the timing and direction right, but when he puts it right in the middle of the zone like that, it's going out of here. This is one of those situations you dream about when you're a kid. He steps up in a big spot and blasts his first home run of the year to take the lead. Storybook stuff has come to life. Now batting. Into the box, Travis Darno. Travis. He swings ah. and rounds it to short. And the throw to first is in time, but the damage is... All right, well, we got the lead. 2-1. So Took seven, no, um, seven no innings to get no some runs, but we managed to get three between the two teams. So, two to go and see if we can hold this lead. Might keep Syndergaard in there now. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Matt Carpenter, he's hitless in his two at-bats so far. I think he's Matt forgotten about sometimes Matt Carpenter when we talk about the best hitters in our sport. I think he's one of the more underrated offensive players. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A swing and a Boom. miss just out in front of that. Still bat throwing ball. at 99 well, miles an hour after there, like 70 pitches. Pitch that's impressive. With. Oh, you think? If you've got a good fastball like he does, that location can be really effective. It looks so tempting to the hitter. But making contact on that pitch could be very tough. And one and one. Oh, he thought about it. On the hands. 
Wow that was a decent breaking ball right there but that's just a pitch that's a little easier to lay off of when you're opposite handed opposite bat you can see the sweep of the ball coming right into you that was a great take and it's one nice. and two count is one and two And he struck him out. Ooh. And there's strike out number be hit. 11. In the Missed ball. well inside there, but we'll take it. One gone here in the eighth as we check our line score to this point. And boy, you can see the story of the game right there in the hit column. Just one hit allowed through seven and a third. He has been awfully tough to solve. Here's Marcelo Zuna. He went down on strikes last time up. First pitch coming. Here it is. Owen won the count. Swing and a blooper. Come on, catch it, right catch it, catch it. Damn, he's and not going to get, get it. Fuck. Drop safe. I'll tell you what, Dero, this guy's been on. One on. After that oh, knock, that's only lucky. their second knock of the game, and it's getting late into this one. Yeah, it's frustrating. You can see it from the manager to the hitting coach to everyone in this lineup. They are really upset with the way lucky. they've swung the bats. Maybe this is the start of something late. Here's Jed Jerko now. That jumps off the page at me. Oh, we're starting to miss on these pitches. Cards. Come on, Noah. They haven't gotten much going against this guy so far in this one. He's been pitching well. And what are the key numbers to look at? First pitch strikes over 70% so far in this outing. Nice. Big swing and a miss at the fastball, and he's behind in the count 0-2. The discipline has just been completely absent from this offense. Nice. It seems like they're always finding themselves behind the count, and, and a big reason why is they're swinging at all kinds of stuff that's not even in the strike zone. Fastball misses in the yeah. dirt as he tried to get him to chase too the low. one. Hey, I don't mind those pitches down below the zone trying to go for the strikeout right there. But you find yourself in a 2-2 count right here. Interested to see what he goes to. Uh, he's just rolling. Right oh, now. what a pitch. That is pitch perfect right there. Excuse the pun. Tying run over at first base. Now, with two outs, it becomes a lot more difficult to manufacture that guy home. Probably need a ball in the gap to give him a chance. Here's the catcher, Yadier Molina. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. I mean, Yadi, when he first broke on the scene, was a defender first and foremost. You can't say that anymore. I mean, he's evolved into a really, yes. really nice Oof, offense. That would have been bad. 0 and 1, the count to Molina. Just a bit high that time as he misses for a ball. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Bit too low there. Come on. Now the 2 1 pitch. In there. Yes! Number two. Come on, one more. Ozuna leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. It's coming down to the wire. And he's got yes! One. 13 strikeouts now, and the inning is over. 13 strikeouts, how's that? The They're down 2 1. I think the record for strikes out, the strikeouts in a single game, I'm not sure if it's 23 or 24 or 26. It's somewhere in the mid 20s, I think. Now we're going to have a conference at the home plate area, so it would appear that we'll see a double switch here. <laughs> John Brebbia will come on now, and he'll slide into the seven spot in the lineup following the double switch. Greg Garcia is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. Number 35. Greg Garcia. Juan Ligares is going to grab a bat here as he looks to try to set the table in the bottom of the eighth as they look for some insurance.
Here's a slider that's inside 1 and 0. The 1 0. High in the air down the right field line. Fowler on the run. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. Cardinals are into their bullpen now as there are the final numbers for their couldn't starter. couldn't quite get that one far enough. exactly how he hoped to get this season started on opening day. Carlos. Here's the shortstop now. I'm uh, just going to sit him down. Sit him down and put Familia. Right, there we go. Cheerus. Here comes the first pitch. This is skied into ah, under it. Fuck. Coming on is Ozuna. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Baka, 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 baka. Second baseman has trouble. Cabrera. So two are gone in the Mets half of the eighth, and that'll bring in the second base. All right, come on, Cabrera. Cabrera. You've had two hits. Well, actually, no, sorry, that's Reyes. Get mixed up. Good timing, just, just got under it for some the stupid pit. reason. Sent on ah, the fuck! The second. Damn it! And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is Five over. pitch inning, that was in. Quick work yeah, there as the Mets are down on four pitches. Just they over, over to trying one. to direct it. I'm just sort of going smashing the analog stick in stupid directions and should just be working it in small amounts. I'm not trying to chase anything. Alright, so we want Familia. Close this one out. Familia See if he can do it. I have to use him in the first game of the year. Jerice. Keep calling him Jerice. His name's Jerice. In for the I still struggle to pronounce this. We just have no South American people in like the UK and, and in Australia, so <laughs> still learning my Spanish from the or Mexican Spanish. The Actually, Familia is probably not even Mexican. <laughs> he's not Mexican. I don't even know where he's from. South American. All right, one strike down. Come on, let's end this. I want a W column in the first game of the year. That misses uh. for the Cardinal shortstop, and it's even at one and one. Well, that's a pretty good pitch right there, that backdoor slider. That's a very difficult pitch to throw, and particularly throw for a strike. Just missed that outside corner right there, but a good pitch and a tough take there by the hitter. Come on, Cherise. A tough Boom. sinker on the inside corner. The one two. Soft liner to yes. the right side. It's one. On to first for the out, and that is how the see. ninth inning gets underway. Final line there for the Mets starting pitcher. And that's exactly how he hoped to get this season started on opening day. Here's Dexter, Dexter Fowler. Fowler. He's hitless in three at right three to this point. And show me the money. Here's the first pitch to him. Knee high slider Ooh. that he takes a look at. Oh. Come on. Here it comes on nothing and two. Bouncer down the line. Oh, yes. Come on, get there. The oh, that was close. That Got him. Down to their final out now. All right, final man, come on. 2-1, it'll be a small victory, but it'll be a big victory. Always a good... For St. Louis, Jose Martinez. No well, always a good starting point when so you win the first game of the year. Out once. He timed it perfectly, just didn't get the direction. All right, splitter. Split this biatch. First delivery come to on. him on the way. And that oh, one stays too low. low, apparently. The 
set and the one ah. pitch. Oh, in missed inside, strike. but it's all right. That, well, it actually ended up going exactly where I wanted. <laughs> anyway. One and one. The one one. And this is swung on and missed. So with that, they come on down to their final strike here this afternoon. Come on, Jerese, show me the money. A show me that mula. Forty-one thousand eight hundred get to their feet now in Flushing. And he lays oh. off the pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. I thought he was going around with that one. Cardinals down to their final strike here. And he lays off, so it's full now. Full count. Two two. Time to narrow your focus up there at the plate. In a one-run game, he doesn't want to walk you, so there's a good chance he's going to get something to handle right here. Come on. As I'm down to their final strike, here it comes. This one's catch that, catch that, catch that, catch that. Yes! What a catch behind the head. All right, one game and one win. This is how we wanted to start 2018. Yes. Pitching and defense game 2-1, the final score this afternoon. The New York Mets jumped ahead in the seventh inning and never gave the lead back. Noah Syndergaard earns his first win of the season well, as he struck out. Took two homers in one inning to get it, but we managed to get it. We just need to practice some of that hitting before the next game. See if we can get a few more on base and convert when we do. So that'll just about do it for my partners Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak. This is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching a presentation of MLB Network. So long, everybody. All right, there we go. Player of the game is Noah Syndergaard. Eight innings pitched, only two hits, uh, hits against him. Thirteen strikeouts and just an ER of one. So, hitting wise, we managed to have two for three and a home run from Adrian Gonzalez and one RBI. Jan Cespedes, one for three with that big home run that put us in the lead in the first place. And Jose Reyes was two for four in the end. Unfortunately, we couldn't get him the run he needed, but Jay Bruce also one for three. So not too many hits, only six in the entire game. But we did manage to get two big homers in the first game of the year. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. Stay tuned for next week. I'm not sure who we're, up, uh, who we're going up against next week, I should say, but we'll definitely try and uh, continue this form that we've started. All right, guys, once again, thanks for tuning in, and until next time, I'll catch you later.